dear esteemed robo engineer I hope this message finds you through the chaos of the thick battle scape you have attracted the attention of the landship commission for we have heard of the great strides you have made in aiding our cause and improving the technology of our forces I will make my words plain time is of the essence once again the rates are pushing deep into our territory taking large swathes of ice and sand and the plutonium beneath your service is needed once again to take the fight to them the enemy has been deploying a new secret weapon out in the field. Ground forces report entire squadrons of tanks, cruisers and mech infantry getting picked apart by singular or small groups of what they now call the Tesseracts. As if the strange trust the stakes and the fighters and the bombers aren't enough. <sighs> you are hereby inducted into the General Army Development Branch of the Landship Commission. Your objective is to develop a new concept of ground bots, unheard of, that will be effective in its chosen role. Whether it be anti-aircraft or anti-armor or anti-inventory, it does not matter, it must be effective. Should you find it within yourself to create more than one such idea, you are welcome to submit more than one. A secondary objective is to prepare the bot aesthetically for the upcoming Lunar New Year or Chinese New Year season. Many of our pilots, remote pilots, are of Chinese descent. Such aesthetic appeal will no doubt raise our morale and help win some battles. Do know that you are not alone, for we have source for many robot engineers, such as yourself. There is comfort in numbers and kinship. I bet you agree. Whereas what would be even better is a little friendly competition, in an effort to boost productivity. The Landship Commission has seen it fit. They will introduce a few rewards for the best three new ground board concepts to be crowned Plutonium 1st, Titanium 2nd, and Aluminium 3rd. All boards will be judged based on the standard DFSMTUA system, which stands for Durability, Firepower, Speed, Maneuverability, Tactics, Usability, and Aesthetics. After much deliberation with the main committee of the commission, we have also decided that the reward will be entertainment softwares, in other words, computer games, of the commission's choice and a certificate. The Protonium Medalist will receive three such entertainment softwares, while the Titanium Medalist 2 and the Aluminium Medalist 1. Your contribution will be vital to the success of our numerous upcoming planned campaigns against the raids. As mentioned, time is limited. The deadline for this affair will be set on the 7th of February, which is the eve of the Lunar New Year. Submit your prototype through the Community Robot Factory with enough components detached to make the prototype affordable and with instructions on how to assemble it. At the same time, present a short corporate video of it. Instructions on how to communicate knowledge of the prototype to the Landship Commission will be found postscript. The results of which bots we choose to be the best three will be out on Lunar New Year itself. Good luck and Godspeed. Yours truly, General Lee Cho Song.